So if you are looking for a very good laptop for content creation with very powerful hardware and an excellent screen around the price of 90,000 rupees then I might have found the perfect laptop for you. I am talking about Asus FRS G14. So watch the full video and I will tell you why this laptop is perfect for you. Before starting if you are new here and you end up liking the video make sure to hit the subscribe button and give some feedback. So when it comes to content creation or editing or graphics work, you will need a laptop with uh, not just a powerful hardware but also a very color accurate screen. And uh, this laptop here checks all the boxes. You can go with any gaming laptop if uh, color accuracy is not an issue. But for graphic related work, I think uh, color accuracy is a huge thing. So let's start with the build quality. The laptop is having a metal build and it is really sturdy and have plain aesthetics and it will look very good but if you are looking for gaming aesthetics it doesn't have it and this laptop weighs 1.6 kilograms which I think is very good. Coming to the screen this laptop is having a 14 inch of 1080p display. It is an IPS panel and as I said earlier it is a very color accurate screen. This screen covers 100% sRGB color gamut and 75% of Adobe RGB and it can go as bright as 300 nits. And also if you want to game it is having a 120Hz screen. And about the keyboard this laptop is having a backlit keyboard but it doesn't have a number bed. And uh, normally laptops have very bad speaker but uh, this laptop here is having very good sound quality for a laptop. It has dual 2.5 volt down firing speaker and 0.7 volts of dual front firing speaker. And this quad speaker setup is capable of producing very good sound. Probably the best audio in a laptop around this price. Coming to the ports, on one side you will find two full size USB 3.2 ports and a type C port. On the other side there is a 3.5 mm headphone jack and type C port and HDMI port and a barrel charging port. And this type C port here supports power delivery. One thing it lacks is an SD card reader but uh, you can always use an adapter. So that's the overview of the laptop. Now let's talk about its internals. So this laptop is powered by Ryzen 5 4th generation processor which is an hexa-core CPU with 12 threads with uh, base frequency of 3 GHz and turbo boost frequency of 4 GHz and uh, 8 MB of cache memory. This processor is pretty much capable to handle anything you throw at it. And uh, this CPU is paired with very powerful NVIDIA GTX 1650 with uh, 4 GB of GDDR6 VRAM. It will be enough to handle all your graphic needs. And uh, for cooling, this laptop is having an excellent thermal design with 5 heat pipes. And you will be able to run the laptop at a higher clock speed for longer times because of the cooling. And uh, for RAM, you are getting an 8GB of DDR4 RAM which is shoulder to the motherboard but 8GB might not be enough so you are also getting an empty RAM slot which you can use to expand the RAM. For storage, you are getting a very fast NVMe M.2 SSD with storage capacity of 512GB and if you want more, you can swap the SSD with a larger one. And about the battery backup, this laptop is having a 4 cell battery with 76 watt hours of capacity which is probably the largest in this price. It is a lithium polymer battery and it will easily last 6 hours with mixed usage. So overall this laptop is a very well balanced laptop with a good battery backup, good thermals, very good screen and an excellent performance and a small form factor which is also lightweight. So should you buy this laptop? Well if you are looking for a very good laptop for graphic related works or video editing or even if you are a student who need powerful laptop which is also lightweight and have very good battery backup then this laptop will be perfect choice for you. So that's all from my side. Thumbs up if you like the video or thumbs down if you didn't. And let me know about your opinion in the comment section or feel free to ask any question. Thanks, I will see you in the next video. Stay home, stay safe.